Hi, I don't have too much time right now because I have to go pick up my two-year-old from preschool. He goes to um, preschool here in Hollywood. And if you're interested in looking for a fabulous preschool, do message me. I found an amazing preschool and the price is crazy. I can't believe how affordable it is. And it's not the kind of preschool where you pay $20,000 a year for a child to sing ABCs. It's really affordable and it's awesome. But I don't have much time and I am starving. And so I'm gonna make a green smoothie. One of my favorite smoothies is called the I Am Energized at Cafe Gratitude. Unfortunately, it's, it's $10 for a smoothie, which is a little insane. I spend $30 a week and get a farm box through my CSA. So spending $10 on a smoothie is, is really expensive, especially when I have a Vitamix here. I have a Vitamix and um, <clears throat> this is not just any blender. It's magical. One Christmas, I really wanted this and I told my husband I was looking to um, purchase a blender and all I wanted from him was a blender for Christmas. And he said, oh, great, a blender. And then I told him, it's a blender that costs almost $500 and his jaw dropped. But this blender, I promise you, is worth it. I am super cheap. I rarely spend money. And I would never spend $500 on a blender unless it was the most revolutionary blender in the entire world. And this thing, I can make smoothies, I can make frozen yogurt from frozen bananas, I can make hot soups. And more importantly, with the green smoothies, it breaks down the cell wall. So you get a delicious, creamy smoothie with none of those like nasty little pieces of kale. So I'm gonna show you how to make the I'm Energized. So in my Vitamix, I'm first going to add about a cup of water. You always start with liquid in the Vitamix. And then I've got a cup of kale. I recommend um, using all organic fruits and vegetables. And then a half a cucumber and one medium celery stalk. I've got some ooh, lemon juice I squeezed, half a lemon because it was very large, but I would go with either one small lemon or half a medium lemon. And I need to catch the seeds. Because those will be very bitter in my smoothie. Okay. And then I'm going to add um, half of avocado or one medium sized avocado. I'm doing half because my avocado is really large. This adds a silkiness. Okay. And then one jalapeno. If you don't like it this spicy, I would take up the seeds or maybe add half. I like spicy, so I'm gonna add the entire jalapeno. And then about a quarter cup of cilantro. This is a neat treat, trick, by the way. My, um, my good friend, she told me she puts all of her herbs in sort of um, either glass jar like this, or you can even use a drinking glass with water. She fills up with her herb, she puts a plastic bag on top of it and sticks it in her fridge. And this has been the best uh, technique to keep my herbs fresh. So I'm just gonna eyeball about half a cup, I mean a quarter of a cup, there we go. And so you need some salt too. I've got this um, Himalayan pink salt, but sea salt will be fine too. Okay. You put the top of the Vitamix and it's going to get really loud in here. What I do is I, there's two different um, speeds, variable and high. I start with variable and I go from one to 10 and then I amp it up to high. And this would take 30 seconds. Hold on one sec and um, cover your ears. It's really loud. <laughs> That's it. My smoothie is a little thick, so I'm going to add some water to it. 
Um, I save all of my spaghetti jars. These are great for smoothies and uh, I don't have to buy anything fancy. It's great. Now I've got a green smoothie to go and I can go pick up my toddler. This is one of my favorites. It's really delicious, even without the jalapeno. The flavor is very satisfying and none of that kale bitterness is there. Smoothies should be delicious. I know a couple people who make smoothies and they throw in everything because they want a very, um, they want a just a high nutrient dense smoothie, but it's disgusting. They put in tons of greens and it tastes bitter and they have to hold on their nose and chase it down. That's not sustainable to me. I'm not going to drink a nasty smoothie, but I will drink a delicious smoothie that would have cost me 10 bucks at Cafe Gratitude, but it cost me maybe three bucks at home. So there you go.